This business has been such a wonderful opportunity because it has really allowed us to really live a life of dynamism. And you know what is a dynamic life? Because dynamic life is when you're not worried about where you start, where you're born, doesn't matter what color, what kind of education you have, it is where you're going. And that is what the BWW and the Amway team have really provided for us. And what, what are some of the things that we have absolutely achieved in this business and we are looking forward to achieve more is the fantastic time that we can spend with our children. I mean, just like what everybody says, quality time. It is not the amount of money you can make. What time can you spend with your children, with your family? That's what really makes a difference. But in order for you to get to that point where you look at these dreams and you say, you know, how can I be there? There are some basics that you really want to think about. And in every field, in every endeavor, there are some basics. Let's look at maybe health, right? Something like Neutralite or health. Anybody who comes to you and says, you know what, I want to lose some weight. Isn't that something that everybody does in the New Year resolution? You go up somewhere, everybody says, hey, I want to lose some weight. Is that a good conversation starter? Sure. What do you tell them? There are some four basics that you always have to think about when you think about it. You tell them, hey, eat healthy, take some good supplements, go for some exercise that's moderate, and at the same time, think positive thoughts. Those are the four big things in that field. Within that, you can change around, and the basics never change. You may go someplace, they may tell you different, but the basics never change. So what we have found in the business is the business has an entrepreneurial background to it. And what everybody talks about is when we were students, especially when I got started as a student, I didn't think about entrepreneurship. I didn't even know how to spell it. I mean, I could spell big compounds and perhaps big vocabulary in Latin, but I didn't know how to spell entrepreneurship. But I learned through the BWW system and working with my spouse how to do it. What are some basics of entrepreneurship? The first basic of entrepreneurship that the BWW system talks about is hang around winners. And this is always said again and again, if you want to be a winner, you hang around winners. How do you hang around winners? You come to the association. So that is one of the first basics that's very important. People who continue to come, hang around the winners, eventually learn some of the important things. The second thing is, a lot of things can be taught, but just a few important things have to be caught that you have to think about. Nobody can come and tell you this is what you need to do. Yes, there is a syllabus, there is a roadmap for you to follow, but there are some things that you have to catch. What is it that you can do for your business? Nobody can come and tell you because you're your own boss. The third important thing that we found as women in the business is to really protect your mind. How to protect your mind is not by saying, oh, I want to be in some cave and not think about anybody or not meet anybody. It's about making sure that you're thinking positive thoughts. We may say, you know what, thinking positive thoughts is so easy, but it's not that easy because until you keep putting new positive thoughts in your head, there's always negative growing all the time. And the last one is, have a vision for your business. Where do you see yourself? And just like people say, if you can fix anything in your life, this business is the easiest thing you can fix. All you have to do is just look at yourself, look at your spouse, work together, work with your team, and you can go forward. Why do we always look for the secret that never exists? The only secret in the business is to do the four basics. Keep doing them over and over and over again till you see the results that you're looking for, right? But unfortunately, what happens is, you know, we, we start blaming other people and blaming ourselves and blaming, you know, the system or upline or downline or crossline for things that, that are not happening in our business. Right? How many of you agree that if you want to make $100,000 in the business, it won't happen if you have one leg sitting here? You need to have multiple legs and the width and the structure that you need to have. So don't blame other people. Fix your structure if you need to fix your structure. Right? You have to do what you have to do to build your business. Right? So don't keep running away from that and, 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 uh, and be afraid of, the fa of, of the four, doing the four basics. Yes, failure is part of the deal, right? Now, here, when, when you hear Peggy Britt talk about, you know, she said, now we do a little bit every day. You heard about that, right? We kept doing a little bit every day. Now, here's a question for you. Did Bill and Peggy Britt fail? Did they see failure? Yes. Did your upline see failure? Did your downline see failure? Did you see failure? That's part of the deal. 
right? When that is part of the deal, don't be afraid of it. Just embrace it and learn from it, right? So you heard about um, um, Thomas Edison when, they, when he made the light bulb. They talked about how many times he failed. See, one th the thing that he said is, I have not failed, but I found 10,000 ways that won't work. Right? It's the attitude that you carry. Your attitude is what is going to, do, going to determine your altitude. Right? So, so embrace that you know, failure and don't worry about it. Right? Success, success is in, your, in, your, in your life doesn't depend on what you consume, but what consumes you. How many of you sold out to this business? Right? How many of you know for, for sure that you know, going diamond is a done deal and you're sold out and said no matter what happens, it's going to get done? That is the attitude that you need to carry. So when you have that kind of an attitude, no matter what happens, doesn't matter. Now you stop counting how many plans you have to show. You have to do what you have to do to get the job done, right? And never deviate away from the basics and say, you know what, I'm, I, I'm upset about this, so I'm not going to show the plan anymore. And I had an attitude like that, you know, when I got into the business, I was so scared of people, scared of success, scared of failure, scared of everything, scared of people. But I had to overcome that. The only way I overcame that challenge is by taking action. The more I stayed out and more I met people and more I, I, I talked to people, the more I overcame that fear of saying hello to somebody. But if I sat at home and said, you know what, I'm, I'm not going to do it because I'm so scared of people, I wouldn't have seen the success. So you have to be out and meeting people face to face. Yeah, all these videos and communication and technology is great. But they never forget the high, high, uh, high tech is great, but never forget the high touch. Only when you see people face to face in their eyes and you're sharing your dream and the vision, they're going to catch the success. They will, they're going to catch the, catch the vision as well. And you have, to carry, you have to keep doing that over and over again. And don't worry about who says no, who says yes. But, but as long as you keep moving forward, and you'll, you'll see the success, right? So three things I'm going to finish up with is you have to plan your business. Know exactly what you want from this business. What is that you're going to do from the next function coming up in April, which is spring leadership, right? Where are you going to see your business? How many legs are you going to have? How, what, what is your PV going to be? How many people are you going to have at, this fun, at, at that function? So that is called your planning of your business. If you don't know how to do these things, your upline is there to help you. Communicate with the upline and say, hey, upline, can we figure out a game plan, know exactly how or what I need to have between now and spring leadership? How many plans do I have to show? How many people do I need to meet? Right? How many follow-ups I need to do? How many people do I need to sign up? How do I set up a customer? All these things is called planning. But once you do the planning, you have to prepare yourself. Now, if you don't know how to show the plan, there are CDs. How many of you are excited about the CDs that BWW is putting out? Right? It's easy to have a DVD, plug in a DVD, push a button, and you show the plan. That's how easy it is to show a plan. Right? Don't be afraid of pushing the button. Okay? So, pre so preparation, right? So, and uh, how many of you are excited about the DVDs and, and the BWW TV fantastic you know, uh, messages on that? And how about your upline? Right? All these things will help you produce that. Right? And then, or, uh, help, you, help you prepare, and then what you do is you produce. So planning, preparation, and production. These are three things happen. But you have to keep doing that over and over and over again. Right? If you don't know a basic, your upline is there to help you. You observe how your upline is handling the situation, how your upline is talking to people, how your upline is communicating with people, how your upline is handling the objections. When somebody has an objection, how your hand, upline is doing that. These are all part of being in the basics. Right? So when your upline go, goes to a show a plan, go with them. Even if it's not for you, they're showing the plan, you have to learn, go with them. So that way you can learn. Right? And you watch and learn. And then what you do is you keep doing, you start doing the plans. You start contacting people. Yes, will you see failure? Yes, that's part of the deal, as I said. But if you keep doing that over and again, you'll definitely see the success.